What it do, Ski? It's your boy, Farewell34, and today I'm here with my reaction video to Riverdale. This one is Season 3, Episode 4. It's my reaction. Oh, it's actually 34! Ha! 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 Anyway, it's my reaction video. Uh, how's it going, everybody? Hope you're enjoying your day. I hope everything went well for you. Um, if you like this video, be sure to leave a like. Uh, yeah, with that being said, last episode we had the whole entire school figure out what what uh, Griffins and Gargoyles is. They all got a copy of it, even though Jughead tried to stop Ethel's efforts. Unfortunately, she succeeded and uh, things are about to get wonky. This episode should be fairly interesting because I think this is going to be the flashback episode with the parents, which is going to be really cool. Uh, so, yeah, with that being said, y'all. Let's get right into the news. If you're interested in getting the full unedited raw reaction, then definitely check out patreon.com slash fable34 in the description down below. Anyway, though, with that being said, let's just dive right into this one. I love you guys. Thanks. Yeet. Let's check it out. A deadly mutating virus had been introduced to the ecosystem of Riverdale, and it was spreading like an epidemic. Because for us, the game was an escape from our nightmarish reality. It's like Fortnite. Ben and Dilton even get it. Well, we still don't have many answers, but from the little that we do know about it, the game seems targeted at impressionable developing minds. Namely, now the stupid game is literally all anyone is talking about. That file is why. A case from when his dad was cornered. I am mm. right in the middle of my affirmation. Same Trust exact thing happened to them. Take a look at this. Obviously. <laughs> That's a face of someone who's got you cornered. <laughs> Try me, bitch. That's what she's saying to her. Look. Like... Or you can just tell me what you know about G and G. All right. Wait, really? The narrative calls for it. You're right, Betty. You deserve to. It was oh boy. Phones had cords. Winona had. Jeez. And everything smelled like teen spirit. Damn it. Oh, started off hot. Everything okay in there? business for my shouldn't you be in a church oh crap girl are you three percent of the time no one's talking to you sierra <laughs> no one's talking to you sierra it's like a freaking video game <laughs> like the dialogue <laughs> when you first start like a new uh, rpg or some shit classic fp jones fp jones <laughs> say your name oh what's up your ass penelope Classy as always, Alice Smith. Just curious, were you born with that mouth? Or is it something Southside mothers teach their bastard babies? I wasn't ready for the smoke. Oh shit, we're going in! Why are we smiling? What? Okay, I'm liking this. This is kind of fun. Worry, I'm not doing it. I'll go with you. Fro oh, Fred. Hi Fred. Freddie Andrews. Freddie Andrews. My basketball team got me in a street last year. <laughs> His voice. He's doing. He's doing the Fred voice. I'm serious crap with the ladies. So. Run fast. We were invincible. I'm so dead. One of the things says. Uh, I guess is eight. Eight early eighties. I don't even no. want you to breathe. Something like that. Maybe. And at the end of the day, you will deliver a 1,000 word essay as to why you're here today. I will be right down the hall in my office all day long. <laughs> why was she shocked like she didn't see the board? Like you were in that room for a hot minute and you didn't see the board? <laughs> it says 1,000 word essay. I'm dead. <laughs> Keller. Sit down, we'll get in trouble. Tell me. Oh, so this is a long thing. He's doing the voice too. This is so funny. How about a round of secrets and sins? When copyrights got gotcha. you. <laughs> Could even see myself running for mayor one day. Ugh, a nightmare job. Why not shoot for something bigger? You can do all those things in a real metropolis. I except look after my dad. 
and he took care of me my whole life. So now, it's my turn. Reinforces wife for the family man. Oh, God damn. I wanted to be the first Jones to go to college. The Blossoms, they're terrible people. But Penelope, to first be Clifford's sister, then eventually his life companion. Every second away from that house, even today, it's a relief. Physically incest, it's disgusting. At least I'm not cleaning up other people's toilets like your mom. Well, at least she has class. She's not stealing child brides out of orphanages. Everybody else being messed up. <laughs> Yo, why did we do this? Like, why do we... <laughs> Yo, imagine it's just like, in the middle of the episodes, we see Betty and Veronica just throwing hands. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Congratulations. You all just upped your sentence. Two we were angry, oh, shit. of course, at each other, at ourselves. Lad, and she locked it up in here, so I'm getting it back. So did any of them right the essay? That's vandalism. Griffins and gargoyles. So this was an urban legend. I heard some kids have been playing at Seaside. I heard one of them had a heart attack and died. In that case, we definitely have to play it, right? Don't be edgy for the sake of being edgy. What? What do you mean? <laughs> Someone had a heart attack. It's like if they went insane or something, and like a demon possessed them. Okay, maybe, but like a heart attack isn't a joke, fam. What did he? What? The gargoyle king. Defeat him and receive the supreme reward. Oh, she wanted to kill FP. That's why. Oh, I'm slow. Me is the game master. I'll guide you through quests. That's how it begins, Betty. The maddening obsession. With the roll of the dice. So they're all gonna play the you game. You approach a well at the center of our common names. The hedges updated. grow behind you, sealing off the exit. Right, I'm gonna talk. A geyser bursts up, depositing the scroll of elders in your hand. Oh. <laughs> That's so good. Is it too good. Late to start another round? Not at all. Oh, well, might else. I suggest we kick things up a notch? Take the game off board. You mean like running around school with Featherhead down the hall? He takes a nap after lunch. <laughs> The chaos emerald. <laughs> yes, milady. No. You know I've been thinking of asking you something. Oh. <laughs> the hell, Hermione. You were gonna kiss me. No, I wasn't. This is a role-playing game. You're too deep in the ARG. <laughs> I'm not actually into you, FP. Alice, are you okay? Lost. I wake up every morning wanting to escape my life. <laughs> God, it sounds pathetic. No, but your hair is the same. It looks great. So. It doesn't. So, FP, what exactly went down with you and Alice? So I pretend that I'm here with you guys. <laughs> and I'm free again. <laughs> you and Fred Andrews? So we're doing We were lonely, Betty. We were young, attractive, in the same room. It was And we dubbed ourselves the Midnight Club. <laughs> Excuse me. And adventures in the room. Oh, that's so good. I rate it Riverdale uh giving LARP LARPing the good representation. The jughead. <laughs> Oh, that's so Come. good. Are you guys playing G and G too? We had thought we were special. Zoiks. <laughs> been for about a week now. Relinquish your game master duties. Make me even. We joined forces, started playing a bigger game, <laughs> and then the line between griffins and gargoyles in real life became blurred, and it rise to the challenge. That's <laughs> so funny. And ascend to the next level yeah. of the game. Kudos on the whole ascension party thing. Very rad. Me? I thought you did all this. It was set up when I got here. We've been monsters all along. I was gonna say, who assorted all those soda pops? Nice. Night was frenzied from the start, and with an impromptu concert heads. by the Fredheads. You 
head ass. <laughs> head ass senior. <laughs> God damn. Released, and we all went a little bit insane. High on fizzle rocks and the very. Confirmed. The lighting is really nice. Flip for your fate. Uh, that's a no from me, Chief. <laughs> Spoilers, she lives. <laughs> oh, gosh. If he was supposed to tell me, tell me what? Oh, they got rid of the body. He died. Fred's dad. <gasps> he died. While we were at the Ascension party list. Oh. Fred found him when he got home. Oh, feels bad. He was sick. And he died alone. Oh my goodness. Because I was high. Running around school like an idiot with you guys. Fred. Look, between this and Featherhead going MIA, we're all a little on edge. Do you want the finger pointed at us because we happened to be doped up in trespassing on the same night Featherhead disappeared? The rumor spread like wildfire. Everyone had a theory about what happened to Prince Whoa, Featherhead. Once you hear flies, no dead that bodies. That oh. My boy slumped. <laughs> Pretty convenient that you left early. Why don't you tell us what you did to Featherhead? Oh. This is <laughs> ridiculous. Fred, you're the radiant knight. You always do the right thing. Uh, maybe you poisoned them when you were setting up the quest. Except... I didn't set up the quest. Neither did Daryl. We were just as in the dark as the rest of you. Guys, the chalices were just sitting there. Any one of us could have drank from them. So whoever invited us to the Ascension party they also were was trying, to, trying kill to kill one or more of us. Well, then we have to destroy the game so that it can't be traced back to us. The manuals. We just have to destroy the manuals. We can Red is so good, man. I was outnumbered. <laughs> Everyone spit. We're making a pact. From this moment on, no one talks about griffins and gargoyles. It's a secret. Forever. To the grave. Ugh. Just say to bet and call it a day. Like, I'm not trying to get... They didn't even got hand sanitizer back then. I don't think so. I don't know, man. Jesus. After playing G&G, &G, it was a return to reality. Okay, that's a decent explanation. The rock star sold his guitar. Oh. Pearl? Where did you get it? Hermione. Don't you worry about that. Mia. Yeah. <laughs> Romeo and Juliet took their curtain call. Didn't Thor help forever and ever ever. Oh, is that the Jason actor? What right outside is it's too dangerous. This is actually a pretty sweet episode, aren't it? Any chance you're free for a malt that pops? I know you're scared, Mom. We can't be silent anymore. Oh, I just realized. Is it called Midnight Club? Like, because the Breakfast Club? Is that supposed to be the joke? Swear to me. We got 20 episodes, fam. She's gonna play it. Don't play the game. You're lying, Chief. I mean, I, I assume they might have renovated the school in, in how many years it's been, right? Or, I guess not. You won't believe the story my mom told me last Sense. All of this is becoming clear. The game, the Gargoyle King. I'm a level three, and it's only a matter of time until I ascend. And I get to meet him. Snigger's nuts. And that was this episode of Riverdale. This was season three, episode 
for uh i actually like this episode i think by far my favorite episode of the season thus far uh i feel like it's been a little lackluster for me personally uh this one was a pretty good context information for the game griffins and, uh, griffins and gargoyles uh context for the families uh and the parents we got to finally get some some more uh, information of them i was wondering like how are they going to make this make sense and i think they did a pretty decent job with the emotional aspect with fred losing his dad the death and stuff like that as a reason why they all split up and never talked to each other again so i actually like how they did that and um really weird to see jughead uh be so deep in it in like however many days it was since he talked to betty uh level three now so i guess we're starting the modern version of griffins and gargoyles gonna be really interesting to see how that goes uh that was a really cringy weird like kind of canted shot where he's like time to play the game betty or some shit that was a little weird ass ending but um interested to see how that's gonna go but anyway y'all that was this episode of riverdale what did you think did you love this uh episode with them going back playing the, the parents did you not like it uh i would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section down below what do you think's gonna happen Move